but I know some sweet boys up in the pen that got bigger balls than you. Oh, you been doing your time looking at sweet boy balls? Screw you, Michael. Ah, but you won't. Here, darling. Why don't you go get yourself something nice, okay? Oh, thank you. <laughs> is, is it seven dollars? I said something nice, not expensive. Knock, knock, ah, niggas. Ah, <laughs> hello, What's up, Lamar? What's up, man? What's up, man? What's up, dog? Franklin here has been awarded Employee of the Month. You fucking with me, right? Don't touch me! Oh, you don't have to call to tell me that. We got work to do, uh, Employee of the Month. Man, fuck you and come on. So, who are you anyway? Who am I? Uh, hello? Take another look. Reality whore, polygamous with nine babies, I really don't give a shit. Exactly, man. My brother from another mother. I mean, I, I hope so, because my mom was kind of a skank back in the day. My yoga is fucked! Oh, is that what they're calling it now? You and your fucking yoga! Did someone say yoga? Oh, yeah. hello, Fabian, darling. Namaste. Namaste. You must be Mikhail. Namaste. Hmm. Nah, I'm gonna go fuck yourself. Michael! I mean, do you have any idea how much money I spent on losing my regional accent? I had to cut all ties with my family. Not because I didn't love them, but because the thought of their lame lives was bringing me down spiritually. You know what I mean? You would really not believe how difficult it is being a celebrity sometimes. Oh, yeah. No. Oh, it must be so tough. Like, I can't even imagine. I'll tell you what's incredible. Fucking incredible. Hey! You mother... Hey! Why? No! You got me out here. You wrote me into your crazy world of bullshit. If it was lies, new age shit, and arguments about how good life used to be, I could have stayed my ass in Los Santos. Hello, Franklin. What's up? You know, you're a real asshole. What did you just fucking say to me? Stop it! You two, you're ruining my fucking yoga! Somebody say yoga? <gasps> yeah, as opposed to eating joggers, smoking meth, and molesting sailors. Uh-uh! It's not molesting if they're lonely, it's patriotism. We are Scooter Brothers! Scooter Brother! Your son, James. He's a good kid. He's a good kid? A, a good kid? Why? Does he help the fucking poor? Oh, slow down, Scooter Brother! What's up? Can a low come up in your crib? Man, fuck you. I'll see you at work. Oh, nigga, don't hate me because I'm beautiful, nigga. Maybe you got rid of that old yee-yee ass haircut you got, you get some bitches on your dick. Where are we going today, Scooter Brother? Hey, Sugar Plum. Daddy? I'm in trouble. What is it? Money? Drugs? Your mother. Drive, Michael! Turn that off! You are not a child! Oh my god, seriously? My brother is such a homo. I think he has a medical problem. Like, more medical problems than the ones he's already been diagnosed with. <laughs> Mental ones? Seriously. They're not meant to be that small. I fucking know, right? I've seen enough of them. <laughs> I married a man-child! Turn the siren off! The other day, I walked in on him, and he was <laughs> over pictures of my friends. <laughs> no, not you. <laughs> the hot ones, Lauren and Lisa. No, I didn't mean it like that. You're beautiful and interesting. It's just the you know, guys don't. They just don't get you. Hello. Hello. Fuck. Whatever. Bitch. <laughs> I miss the old days. Good times. Watching you shake it. I miss every girl calling you the one pump chump. You know, I've been towed three times in the last month, and the quickest response was 47 minutes. I'm just saying, maybe they need a new system. Or maybe you need a new car.
What you going slow up the road for, dog? Move over so the traffic can flow through. Whatever, nigga. I'll let something flow through your ass. Dog, I ain't too sure that joke works, dog. Oh, shit. Don't do this. Just, just let me turn myself in, please. No can do. I'm a dedicated servant of justice, my friend. Count yourself lucky I haven't trust you in duct tape and thrown you in the trunk. Although, now I've said it out loud, I kind of like the idea. Go to college. Then you can rip people off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. You are a hipster. What? You're a hipster. I hate hipsters. Classic hipster denial. I want to bring you in on the ground floor this time. That's not a joke about disabled access. I didn't think it was, but now I do. I abhor hipsters. I eat them for fun. <laughs> hipsters love saying they hate hipsters. You know, I ran big time hoods in LC. We took major scores. You can't even handle a drugstore? Oh, you and your stories. Shut up about LC. Shut up about the bank job and your family and your friends. I don't care. So at least I know I ain't the least confident crook in the city. I swear, it's just this guy. Look, man, can you just lose the cops? What I really fucking do? Self-hatred. Common hipster affliction. What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane. All right, I'm coming. For my boat! Maybe you're not a classic garden variety hipster, but you're what the hipsters aspire to be. You, Trevor, are the proto-hipster. <laughs> Michael, they're fucking us! The suits! And they don't even wear suits! You're talking bullshit. You're trying to wind me up. But I'm very, very angry, and I want this conversation to stop right away. Hipster. Fuck you! Fuck you, Michael! Say it again. That made my point. I'm not a sadist. You! God damn one! Green light! Green light! Martin Madrazo, give you green light! Oh, I'm scared, lady. Just fucking terrified. Ah. Green light! Green light! Not Madrazzo! Fuck you! Oh, did you see that shit? Fucking put that bitch's face against the glass. Did you see that? Yeah, you're a real <laughs> stout. <laughs> what were you doing skulking around that quarry like a common toad anyway? You actually wouldn't find a toad in a quarry. It's too dry. Whoa! Are you getting smart with me, admin criminal? Just keep him away from me and the children, you low-life, whoremongering asswipe! Did someone say yoga? No, I think she said whoremongering asswipe. Can you see me, Trevor? Can you see me? You wouldn't believe this, Ron. One of these assholes is having a seizure or something. That's me! That's me! Don't shoot! Would you just let it go? Now that doesn't sound good! Hey, that's the engine, man. We ain't chasing shit in this thing. Hold it together! Ah! My fucking boat! Hey! It's just a thing! At least you still got a son! Well, isn't this nice? You didn't tell me we were double dating. Sorry, guys. This part of hunk of love is all mine. <laughs> Brilliant! You're just a drunk, lame dad. You know what? That might just be the nicest thing anybody's ever said to me. So will you buy me a car? Oh, my N-word, huh? What What's up, up homie, huh? Oh. <laughs> oh. What a, is that how you act, huh? When a, when a friend makes a mistake, huh? No, really? <laughs> all we do is scream at each other. No wonder I can't get a job. It's all your fucking fault. Or... It's not, but it's partly your fault. I I mean, I just want to impress you. By selling my boat to some gangbangers? Bros, I wouldn't stay in there too long, okay? This alarm is gonna go at some point. You gotta be kidding me! 
Why did I employ a hacker who can't run antivirus software? Bullshit! Oh, I like it, denial! That is first part of the grieving process, brothers. Now let's all hold hands, huh? I am Mr. Chang's humble translator. Mr. Chang now. You all speak Spanish, speak it to each other! Here you go. Now, uh, put this in your mouth. A bad day hunting still beats a good day working, my pa always used to say. What is this thing in my mouth? And why do I have the feeling I'm not the first person to use it? So, Mike, what were you doing? I was making myself a juice. Broccoli, raw kale, fish oil. What? This recipe I got is packed with nutrients, fibers, vitamins, and it don't taste bad. I'll send you the recipe. Anyway, get this. I'm making it. The blender slips, juice goes everywhere. I'm about to clean it up when I find this bag of grass. Big fucking bag, Jimmy's, right? Okay, just that moment, Amanda comes in, sees me there with- I didn't ask for a blow-by-blow -blow of how you lost your last ounce of masculine pride. I wanted to know what you've been doing for a decade. You feel that? Water's getting warmer. You wet your pants, Davy? This is a cooling tunnel. Of course it's getting warmer. No one urinated. Uh, I know for a fact that that ain't true. I'm gonna miss this when you move out. Does that mean you're getting me a house? I'm not quite ready to go yet. But if I am going, I'm taking the maid and the credit card. Still stripping so much, Amanda? Still mass- so much, Trevor. Dad, you're embarrassing me. These are my friends. Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. That was what? Our house? Oh, Amanda. Oh, creepy. Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but... Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just, what? I always thought I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet your generation have left us if you're the good guy. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> Who are these clowns? That's my dad and Trevor? Two dads. Uh, <laughs> Great. Wow. Very San Andreas. My parents loved me so much, they put me in a little lacy surprise campaign when I was three. Ooh, good for you. I didn't work till I was two. I, I was signing autographs at the expo. People want to meet you after that video on fame or shame? Yeah, yeah, the videos. Ah, uh, well, now you just got to find a way to make money out of it. <laughs> <laughs> So like, yeah, the really important thing is to make sure everything's clear. That's what my dad says. Make it clear. I mean, it's me, him, and this other guy who no one really understands because he like doesn't speak or do anything. And I'm like, we're all supposed to be equal, the three of us. And I'm like, dad, that's not fair. And he's like, I don't make the rules. And I'm like, yes, you do. Now go. I need to meditate. Who are master? Or both. Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> but you know, Roland, it's Ralph. Hey! What did I tell you about answering back? You know, Roland, this could be a lot worse. Steve Haynes, amigo, but you probably knew that already. Sorry, your name tag must have fallen off. Joe Phillips! Mr. Cho has requested a word! Hey, ho ho, I'm not the guy you're looking for! Hey, how's it How's it Get the boyfriend! Boyfriend? Motherfucker. Tell me about your boyfriend. <laughs> yeah, Jimmy, are you ready to talk about him yet? Obviously that question is for me. I mean, all your friendships don't even last a night. At least I'm getting some. We have your lover. Whoa, 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 whoa. My lover? My Cody Santa, you live in your trailer together with the maid. You said a man is stuck in a tree. And he needs my help? Part of you would rather leave him there because he's a bit of a dick. But you're doing your civic duty. 
Okay, shit, show me. I've officially lost my damn mind. Please be quick. I'm roaming in the United States of America. It's me, you nutcase. I picked up some clothes from your friend Tyler Dixon. There's even a skid mark. What, boy? He just jumped out of a fucking helicopter. His parachute fell to open? And now you kind of wish he'd missed a tree. But morality is a human construct and you are not hardwired to think that way? I can't believe I'm getting smart talked by a fucking dog. They should put it on my show. Have you seen my show? You mean how to dress like a salesman on a cheap golf weekend at a third-rate country club? <laughs> Say what? Wait, you talking about my kind of bitches or yours? This shit is getting weird now, man. Are you taking a dump? Ah, why do you care, huh? Oh, come on, dude! Do me a solid here! Hey, bro! <laughs> you mind giving me a hand here? Man, that's a cool-ass dog you got, homie. What dog? That dog that saved your... saved your ass, man. Dude, I have no idea what you're talking about right now. What the fuck? Listen. We need help with something else. Some of the government, some of it is pretty corrupt. Uh, how's your mother? Oh, she's great. <sighs> no, she's not. She's bored. I mean, all this mesmerizing, tantric sex she's been having with a much younger, better built, caring and compassionate man is great and all, but what's she gonna do for the other six hours of the day? What the fuck? My dad's the one you wanna kill! He's on the front of this thing! Okay, let's <laughs> me off and do a cop. Slap me around. We got options, baby. Man, what the fuck is wrong with you, nigga? I was getting us paid. What the fuck is wrong with you, nigga? That was a good phone. A good phone? The cops was all over, nigga. I could have swallowed my car. Try to triangulate that. Hey, it's, uh, cozy in here. Scooch up, homie. Yeah, scooch over here. Scooching in that crazy dude? Oh, hell no, that nigga stank. Get over here. I don't bite. They ain't what I heard. All cannibalistic and shit. Frank, what you been telling him? I say what I see, homie. You dig on man meat. Name's Tim, with two M's. Because, mmm, mmm, I am hungry 24-7. What's your name, buddy? Michael, with one L. Because that's how it's spelled. Fuck. Well, he didn't make it. You sure, man? Cause he might be a... Oh! Oh! No, he didn't make it. What you funny, huh, motherfucker? His name's yeah. Tim, with two M's. Because, mmm, mmm, I am hungry, 24-7. What's your name, buddy? Trevor, with three B's. Why is it whenever people talk about reincarnation, they're always a king or a general or a famous person? How come they're never... A surf, or a rock, or a bug. Were you a fan of Frank Mathers? Frank Mathers? The TV guy who used to do the shows about space until he became obsessed with undersea exploration? No, not a huge fan. Frank was my husband. By not a huge fan, I mean, not a huge fan as much as a fanatic. Come on, man, untie me. I've been here for hours. <laughs> it would be so much funnier if I didn't. He was a cruel and heartless man. Well, like I said, I was not a huge fan. Oh, thank God. I'm in so much trouble. Can you give me a ride? Please. I'll repay you, I promise. Mmm, naked road trip. I'm in. How did you two stay married? Even more surprising is how did you stay single? <clears throat> gotcha, you little bastard. There, there. I know, this is weird for all of us. You're gonna make a batshit crazy lady very happy. 
Okay, uh, now get back to Carrie before she uses this as an excuse to go back to rehab. You think it's clever to disrespect women? Disrespect? What? I, I wasn't disrespecting, I was just saying we should kill her. You called her a bitch! Ain't you got a mother? Everyone got muggers, at least one. Chalk! Celebrity newsflash! Maniac steals collar from Gary McIntosh's dog in Rockford Hills! Oh, how delightful! Mrs. Thornhill will have me sporting that in the bedroom before the week is out. <laughs> oh, I, I, I joke, of course. Let's go! Wait, come on. I'm driving. You can jerk me off if I get bored. I'm joking. You can suck me off. Are we gonna stop for ice cream? Franklin's asleep. It's just me and you. What? What you trying to say? You want me to jack you off or something? Jesus, no. God, no. Of course not. Unless... Man, you's a sick fiend. Are we nearly there yet? No, Wade. Are we nearly, nearly there? You keep this up, you're not gonna get there at all. Can you tell me a story? I asked for a fair day's pay after a fair day's work. Then he kind of got a little angry. So I admit, I kind of got a little angry. Did you kill him? What kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't kill him. Oh, fuck. But I did kidnap his wife. Oh, no. Oh, shit. What the fuck did you do? Oh. Oh, Trevor, what have you got all over yourself? You're all red. You got, you got syrup? Yeah, syrup. Accidents. We've all been there. We sure have, but, but it don't taste like syrup. Don't taste me, all right? Just no licking. Come on, man, knock it off. What? I'm gonna break your fucking fingers, you don't knock that shit off. Well, please, all right? You'd alleviate the boredom. So weird. They kept saying that youth is wasted on me, that I've ruined society. Which is interesting, considering they're the worst generation in the history of the world. I know, right? The generation before them survived the Great Depression, fought the Second World War, and built America to greatness. The then they stepped in and fucked it all up for everybody. Oh, wait. Sorry, were, were you joking? You're not a baby boomer, are you? No, I'm 100% Gen X. Haven't you picked up on how bitter and cynical I am? <laughs> okay, just thought I'd check. <laughs> Nowhere near a true boomer. Come on, Hey, what are you crazy kids doing back there? I tell you what, while you're sweeping the front porch, why don't I work on her back plumbing? Huh? What did you say? How about I suck those right out of your balls, big guy. Get this party really started. <laughs> <laughs> he reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men that can't get erections. <laughs> Thank you. You're like the best. We've got a little unfinished business to attend to. Mm. Smells like fishmongers in there. You see anyone down there who might be an Azerbaijani? Fuck do I know? You might be an Azerbaijani for all I know. Let's see what we got here. Huh? Real professional. <laughs> Whoa, hey, stay in the car there, homeboy. I'll deal with you later. Yeah, fuck you too. Car going north on El Rancho. Woo, 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 woo. All units be advised, we have a possible joyrider heading west on Howick in a black C-type. Hey, man, you getting other cops on this shit? Nah, homie. Thought you'd appreciate the authenticity. Oh, okay. Well, I fucking don't. How you doing? Hey, great, really great. How are you? Well, I know how you are. No, you don't. I have never heard such crap in all my life. Hey, I know my truth, brother, brother. Yeah? Good, and I know mine. 
Moron, moron. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined, then. Well, here we are, Al. Curtains up. It's time for your final scene. Please, no! Don't do it! Jock, we've been worried sick. I regret to report the sad passing of Mr. L. Dinopoli. Train accident. Very sudden. Chugga, 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 chugga. Franklin, share? Yeah, come on, kid. It can't be worse than Trevor's. All right, man, shit. Okay, the score was like two stacks, man. 2G, take home on your first gig? Fuck, that ain't bad, man. Man, the whole score was two stacks. Only I didn't see none of that shit. Die pack went off, homie. Money was useless then. Die pack? <laughs> you amateur! I knew I shouldn't have told you shit. Hey, we got a problem up here. Sprinkler system. Can't see anything. Man, can I have to shut it off? Lucas. Sprinkler system. You got any ideas? Dude, I would not know where to start. Maybe, like, take a screwdriver to him? Of course. Why did I ask? Molly's highly strung. She's not gonna stop and talk it out with a deranged killer chasing after her. That ain't who I am. Today? I count on you having better things to do. Well, I don't. I'm a lonely man, and social media is my life. It's given me the recognition I've been denied my whole life. I can make snarky comments and glib pronouncements and lap up the adulation, banishing any form of dissent. I'm a king, and Bleeder is my kingdom. Okay, um, that's pretty sad. Authorization? Good. Good? Good. So, uh, since you all on this mentorship slash role model slash inspiration tip with the homie Franklin, I was wondering, you know, why don't you give an up and comer the game? Yeah, slash. Sure, slash. First and only lesson, loyalty. Dick is burning. I'm so dehydrated. If you hadn't stopped, I don't know what I would have done. Well, I stopped because I got a soft spot for a man in panties. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Fuck. Ah. Oh. Man, we've talked about this hygiene thing before, bro. I invite you into my home, this is how you repay me? It's like living with a fucking horny skunk. We cause a distraction out front. Make them think we're dumb. <laughs> well, we've never had a problem convincing people of that, have we? <laughs> Where have you two been? Getting some fresh air. Talking of beautiful things. Yes, I hear Stockholm Syndrome is very nice this time of year. Someone there? I'm gonna start shooting! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> yeah, you like that, don't you, huh? Take it off! <laughs> Get the fuck off me! I thought I was on that guy! So you sit on his face? It's called teabagging? Um, so, so we're headed to Los Santos soon? Soon. I gotta make a stop. Oh, what's your stop? Ice cream? Huh. 